Man, I didn't even like clubbing. I was too old for clubbing at 22, bro. Mind my own business. And then once you're done with your theatrics, then we can talk. Hakalikopa. So what? My shoes are ugly. Did I ask you if they were pretty? No. I'm far too old for you to just be rocking up at my house and announced. What is that? Gehanna when I want to so. And then you suddenly rocking up. I was like, hey, friend, don't call me friend. Uh-uh, uh-uh. Whoa, whoa. We are not friends. To post every single thing. What did I eat for breakfast? I'm posting it on a snap. What, I, what am I reading right now? I'm posting it on a snap. What restaurant am I sitting at? I'm posting it on a snap. I'm like, no. Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to another video. It is I, it is just Katleo. I'm so excited to have you over. I wanted to do something pretty cool today. Keep it light, keep it fun, keep it flirty, keep it thus. And actually just do something that I haven't really done on the channel before without it having to be a just Katleo or a just Katleo, without it having to be a candid with cat or an unpopular opinions or something like that. I wanted us to just have a little bit of fun. And I came across this challenge on TikTok. This challenge was probably done eons and years and a kajillion years ago, but I'm, I fell on it sometime this week and I, at, at like two in the morning while I was in bed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. um, and I fell onto it and I was like, oh, I love this. I love it, but I, I want to do it as a YouTube video. And it is the challenge, yeah, I am too old for this. So I saw everybody just doing videos. My nose is so itchy today. I don't know, this whole area of my mouth is so itchy today. So I saw everybody doing this challenge or whatever, this trending thing on TikTok. And I was like, oh, this is so cool. But now I want to put it onto YouTube. And I want to talk about some of the things that I'm too old for, bro. And I actually want to get into it. Like I want to full on attack it. Okay. So I would love for you to engage and actually share with me what you're too old for down below. Whether you're 25, 22, 19, 20, 35, 45, it doesn't matter. Share with me down below what you are too old for. I'll get started. Okay. I will. I wrote them down. I wrote them down. I made sure. I made a show. First thing that shouldn't even really be difficult to dissect or agree with, especially when it comes to me and you've been watching my content online for a while, clubbing. Man, I didn't even like clubbing. I was too old for clubbing at 22, bro. I was too old for clubbing at 23. Clubbing for me is a no-no. It can be someone's birthday. And let me tell you something. For me, what constitutes as clubbing? Rockets. Let me give you an example. Not taboo, not snowy, not, 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 not whatever the names of the clubs are, cha. None of that. The, the weather's doing crazy things outside. For me, rockets. Just going somewhere where there's gonna be a bunch of people and sweat and now you're having to shuffle through people, going to the toilet, listening to people cry and talk sob stories and put makeup on and toilets that are dirty with tissues all over the floor. Uh uh, no, you could not pay me to leave my bed and land up at a club. I don't like it, I'm uncomfortable, I don't like people being all up in my personal space. Um, I've tried to do it for my friends who want to go out and have a good time from time to time. I just can't stand it. You couldn't pay me nothing for me to go to a club. I cannot stand it. I'm too old for it. I was old for it when I was 23. So catch me outside. Okay? Thanks. Catch me several seats. Okay? Unnecessary drama. Amen, I'm too old. Amen, I'm too old. If you're gonna come at me with unnecessary drama, I do not like being involved in social media influencing drama, content creator drama. I do not like being involved in drama with friends, with family. Catch me several seats outside. 
catch me several seats outside. You will be dramatic by yourself. Because me, I'm not going to do that. I will engage with you. I will share some things with you. I will talk to you, try and make it. But if you're going to make it dramatic, nah. I'm not about it. I'm not about it. I get to dramatic only one. I couldn't care them. I really couldn't. I'ma let you be. Go on over and have my drink or drink my water. Right? Sip on my tea. Mind my own business. And then once you're done with your theatrics, then we can talk. After that, forget about it. Start losing your shits. We're sitting at a restaurant and I'm trying to have a conversation with you. And then come pimps at the fuba. I'm out. I need to talk to you about anything. I'm out. I'm gone. I don't need the drama. You want to come at me, you're going to come at me correct. Right? I don't even like to associate myself with online drama. You want to into the trend and come toxic what what? Hey, this guy and this girl is hey what what? Toxic femininity, whatever. I'm not going to be part of spaces like that. No, no, no. Even though I know that my opinion is quite valuable in some of these these spaces or in some of these conversations, but am I going to involve myself? No. Let dramatic too much, Helen. Let dramatic. Having to repeat myself. What I'm not going to do is repeat myself. Kibuile, kibuile. Uh uh. Kibuile, kibuile. What I'm not going to do is repeat myself. If you didn't hear me the first time, that's it. Then you weren't listening. That's it. I am not going to do it. Whether it's a friend, whether it's a partner, whether it's kibuile. Especially if it's something that I'm really, really not happy about or I'm really upset about or I'm really actually sharing a really important part of me, my story, my life, my situation with you, my anger towards you, my sadness towards me and towards you and all of that. And you you say come again? No, I'm not coming anywhere again. Never that. Because the mere fact that I have to repeat myself shows me you are not listening. And for me, listening is very important. If I'm going to engage with you, listen to me. And if you're going to be dismissive of that, yeah? I can't do this right now. Okay, then don't. I'm not going to repeat myself. We're not going to have this conversation again. That's pretty much that. I am too old. I am too old and too beautiful to handle all that nonsense. <laughs> did I say beautiful? I did. The next point is unsolicited advice. I do not care to know that you feel that my t-shirt is crinkled. I don't care. I didn't ask you if my t-shirt was crinkled. I'm not trying to be mean about saying I'm just giving a really stupid example of unsolicited advice, but it's me saying that if I didn't ask for it, it really isn't necessary for you to give it. I don't care. I don't give unsolicited advice. So why should I take unsolicited advice? <laughs> why should I take unsolicited advice? I don't give it. So why am I bothering myself, my darling? No. I don't care about the fact that you mad and you you angry with me and blah blah blah. You trying to share with me that um my hair color looks to I it's amen. 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 Will I be thankful if you say my hair color is great? Yes, of course. But unsolicited advice where especially you trying to be negative belittle, degrade, insult, be rude. I don't care damn. It's like yeah, water back. Except I'm not a duck. If you get it, you get it. <laughs> If you don't get it, forget about it. I'm too grown to require unsolicited advice. The only person who is allowed to give me unsolicited advice is my therapist. Otherwise, I can link with you. Hakale kopa. So what my shoes are ugly. Did I ask you if they were pretty? No, they are mine. I'm wearing them. So there must definitely be something about the shoe that I like. Obviously, yes. Of course. Okay. Having my boundaries disrespected. I am too old for that. I am far too old for you to disrespect my boundaries. If you are not going to listen to me and respect the fact that right now, right now I'm a need us to come to this conversation. 
And right now, I'm gonna need us to do this. And you're gonna go ahead and disrespect my boundary? Shop. Grin. I'm too old for it. I'm not gonna deal with it. Forget about it. I am far too old for you to just be rocking up at my house unannounced. What is that? What is that? I am far too old for you to be all up in my personal space. I know we're standing in a queue, but damn. Back up. That's my boundary, man. That's my personal space, man. Come on. I am far too old to be. I don't. Why are you touching my hair? Why are you touching my hair? Like I'm giving really stupid examples, but they're actually examples that are really, really important to me. I'm far too old for any of that stuff. So what do you think you're doing? Hmm? What do you think you're doing? What I'm not going to do is appreciate that. I'm not going to appreciate that. I am far, and I am far too old to be telling you what my boundaries are. I can share with you if you're not familiar with the fact that I do not like my personal space being invaded a little bit. I can share it with you. <laughs> back up, little bit, back up. <laughs> but if I don't mind, you'll know. You'll know why I, I, I don't mind. But in JJ, uh, come at me correct. I am too old to have to explain why I have to say no. I said no, that's it. Okay. Katla, can you meet me at um, the coffee shop at around 3 o'clock? There's something I need to discuss with you. That time it's quarter to 3. No. How? Why? But you said you're at home. No. I am too old to actually explain myself and the decisions that I make, especially when I'm saying no to something. If I say no, there's it. It ain't gonna change, buddy. It pretty much is what it is. You can catch me several streets outside. Kehanna when I'm on a soup. And then she even walk back to Hanna Joan. Who look at? Who's that this guy? Yo, wait. Fake people, fake friends. I couldn't be bothered. I couldn't be bothered. I know you because we are colleagues. I know you because we are whatever. But what we're not gonna do. My darling, what we're not going to do is go to an event where we've all been invited to that event. And then you suddenly rocking up. It's like, hey, friend, don't call me friend. Uh-uh, uh-uh. Whoa, whoa, we are not friends. Don't do that. Don't do that. Now, sir, do sir, okay, and whatever. Meanwhile, we never engage with each other. So please don't mind me if I keep to my little corner. Because I'm not going to do the fakeness, the pretending, the all of that. I, I can't, I can't, I, I can't, I can't. You're not doing me any favors by being pretentious or fake. And I'm not going to do that too because I feel like that's messed up. Why are you trying to be, why? Why should I, why should I be trying to be fake with you and stuff? No, no. Fake friends, even worse. Because if I realize that you are not here for the right reasons, and trust me, people will always, always pick some wild ass reasons to surround themselves with you. Do you hear what I'm saying? Wild. And then as time goes, you start to see stuff. You start to see stuff. You have your boundaries disrespected. You get disrespected. You're not treated equally in the friendship and the whatever. And all these things start cropping up. I don't have time. I'm far too grown. The list of my friends, it's yeah. Yeah. The numbers that I call. It's yeah. It's 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 yeah. So that's that on that. Don't let let's not let don't do that. Don't do that. Ah oh, Lord. This one is a very big thing for me. I am far too old to post every single thing I do online. To post every single thing I do on Insta snaps. To post every single thing. What I eat for breakfast, I'm posting it on a snap. What I what am I reading right now? I'm posting it on a snap. What restaurant am I sitting at? I'm posting it on a snap. I'm like, no, I'm too busy trying to live in the moment of where I'm at, who I'm with, that I'm far too old to do all of that. My time is limited. 
Kimu Holu. I don't have time. I don't have time for Verda. So no, I'm far too old to be posting things online every five minutes. That's why from me, you'll get a, a story every couple of days. You'll have me engage with you on Instagram and all of that every couple of days. Uh, that kind of stuff. I don't po- I'm on a holiday. You're going to see it when I come back. You'll see one snap that day. You're not going to see another. And I feel like I'm too old for that. I'm not always constantly sitting with my phone. I'm trying to be present. And for me, that it's important to me. To me. Okay? That's it. <laughs> Those are some of the things that I feel like I am too old for. Explaining myself. I don't have time. I don't have time. The only time I will explain myself is if I'm actually trying to help you understand something. But if I'm going to constantly do it over and over and over, no, of course not. I'm always apologizing, I'm apologizing, I'm apologizing. No, no. If you refuse to hear it the, the first time and tell me your wait, come again, say again, then I say it one more time, I'm not gonna do it again. I'm not going to over explain myself. I'm not gonna do it. I'm not gonna do it. Kim Holo. Okay? Kim Holo. I am too old. <laughs> I'm just coming up with them on the spot at this point. I'm too old to have to explain, justify any of my actions to anyone. Do I smoke cocaine? None your business. Smoke weed? None your business. Drink five times each day. Every day I'm having a bottle of wine. None of your business. I am too old to have to explain my decisions to anybody. Explain my life to anybody. That's all I'm saying, yeah? No, I'm too old for it. I would really love to know what you feel like you're too old for. Let me know down below. And if you want to know more things that I feel like I'm too old for, let me know. And I'll film another one. There's far too many. I just, these are some of the ones I could think of on the spot. But uh, let me know. Let me know. And I'll definitely do that for you. As always, if you enjoyed the video, please like, subscribe. Definitely join the family. We also have a membership space where we have bonus content, bonus vlogs, bonus everything. It's always there always there every other week there's a video on the membership space so show your love and support the space so that i can continue to support to be there for you and continue to do this part of my life that i love 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 so much thank you always for choosing me over and over again i'm gonna go now i will see you in the next video until then sayonara voice chill